In this video, we try to compress image content with PCA. We read image and compress it with PCA method. We use grayscale image given as a NumPy matrix and uh, with a specific number of dimension reconstruct image. We want to implement PCA reconstruction method, um, use the input image and apply PCA, delete the wells dimension with the small eigenvalues and rebuild a reconstruction image based on the strongest value. In order not to prolong the video, I have already written the code. Uh, before I describe the code, I want to talk about the principal component analysis or PCA algorithm. PCA has a strong application in image recognition and dimension reduction of high dimensional data. The PCA algorithm can transform the original data linearly by calculating and choosing eigenvectors with larger eigenvalues which can not only remove useless noise but also reduce the amount of computation. First of all, we have to import the libraries because we implement the PCA with eigenvector and eigenvalues. Uh, we import ID with CPy algebra package and other libraries that used uh, in different parts of codes. In this cell, we read the image, the famous image Lena JPEG and then with image convert we convert image to the gray scale and then uh, we convert this image to the matrix with mp.array and uh, reshape that reshape that matrix to the original image dimension the size of image is uh, uh, 225 in each uh, rows and columns. Here we define our function PCA reconstruction with uh, two inputs. Um, actually the input of the, um, of the uh, method is image uh, gray and, and the number as a vals for reducing the uh, dimension uh, with this number we change the the image gray with mp.array to the matrix and reshape that matrix to the original size of uh, image um, dimension here we here we calculate the uh, covariance matrix uh, we want to uh, calculate the covariance matrix of a uh, sample each column uh, represents a feature and uh, each row represents a sample the sample matrix subtracts the mean the mean of corresponding sequence from each sample then um, then uh, eigenvalue, the composition of uh, covariance matrix, uh, is performed to obtain uh, eigenvalues and eigenvectors. We extract it with uh, NP algebra I to, uh, to get an eigenvalue and eigenvector. Then we put the size of eigenvector in P and in the uh, next line we sort our eigen uh, value in order to decide which eigenvectors we want to drop uh, for lower dimensional subspace we have to take a look at uh, the corresponding eigenvalues of the eigenvectors the eigenvectors with lowest eigenvalues uh, build the least information about the distribution of the data and uh, those are the ones we want to drop so uh, 
uh, we do that we sort the eigenvalues and then we choose the the eigenvector with the highest eigenvalues and uh, here we use the uh, we use another input of the function the vals uh, and vals um, uh, have to um, greater than zero and uh, less than p the size of vectors uh, for choosing the um, the vals of eigenvectors the highest vals of eigenvectors in the next uh, step we dot product eigenvector transpose and covariance matrix we computed matrix to transform our sample onto the new subspace the projection matrix is uh, um, actually is uh, constructed by extracting the eigenvectors uh, corresponding to the largest vals uh, eigenvalues and uh, in the next step we reconstruct image by by that product of the projection matrix and eigenvectors and for um, and to uh, make the uh, make the image quality better we use some normalization and add it to the uh, dot product of the projection matrix and eigenvectors finally the result of this uh, function is the reconstruction image here we can visualize our um, our method our PCA result with uh, different valves for decreasing the, the dimension here we can see the image with the, the with the reduced dimension the true image is here and the image with uh, 20 dimension 10 dimension and 5 dimension and uh, it is not difficult to find that most of information retained with 20 dimension the dimension is reduced from 225 to uh, 20 dimension which reduce, uh, reduces um, the computational complexity of image classification the features uh, before and after reconstruction we can see are still obvious.